So there's this couple in St. Paul the Star Tribune found earlier this week, and this couple proves you cannot hurry love. So here's the deal. They met 37 years ago and somewhere along the way decided to take a vow. If both of them were still single when they hit 50, they'd get hitched. Wow, talk about keeping your word. The stars aligned, the time was right, and that wedding is actually really happening, and it's happening tomorrow. So our Ferlin Webster sat down with the couple to hear their love story. All throughout history, friends have made packs. From the young kids on the playground who make a deal to become astronauts, or to the college friends who vow to become millionaires, to these two people. Was that your graduation? It, yeah, it might have been. Ron Palmer and Kimberly Dean have an interesting story to tell. You two made a pact. Yeah, we did. <laughs> what kind of pact is this? You want me to do this yeah, one? Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. So years and years and years ago, I would say probably 20 yeah, I think we're in something, our 30s, I don't maybe. know. Both single, both had gone through crazy relationships. Ron was talking about benefits and I was talking about kids and he goes, I don't, I don't have anybody to leave any of my stuff to. And I just jokingly, I went, just leave it to me. Let's just get married and, and he went, okay. <laughs> and that's how the joke started. A joke, yes, but love has a way of making these jokes come back around. Henceforth to where we are now, it's like, oh my God, do you realize that we are in our 50s? And little did we know that that whole joke was coming true years and years and years later. Yeah, I always joke that uh, I can retire early as long as she carries health benefits. <laughs> <laughs> so you're looking forward to it, huh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you still have health benefits. Yeah, I do. Okay, all right. There you go. Just checking. Yeah. <laughs> the couple met at St. Agnes School in St. Paul and dated when Ron was a senior and Kimberly was a freshman, but the relationship didn't last. After high school, I. I wanted to go sow my oats, <laughs> and and uh, so we, we broke up, and but we, we remained friends. It seems like you guys are true friends. I mean, true friends make packs and they keep. Them. Oh yeah. 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 No, we've been we've been friends for 37 years. We started out friends, and we're still friends. Tomorrow you become ultimate friends. Yeah, I Pretty guess much. I guess you could say that. Yeah. yeah. If someone says to you, a marriage that started off with a joke couldn't work, you would say what? <laughs> well, how serious is a joke? <laughs> I think the pact was a joke. I think the actual thing of what we're doing tomorrow is no joke. Marriage is a commitment, and that's something that I think that we really want to do to each other. How do you like my tie? I'm sporting a big, nice, fat tie. I'm going to tie my tie like that for the wedding. No. <laughs> well, you don't always get your way. No, yes I do. <laughs> They're going to be just fine because they have the yes, one thing are. that makes it work, right? Yeah, they do. Love and friendship. commitment, friendship, laugh, communication right. skills. Bingo. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so a lot of things make it work. You know, it is. What'd you learn? I learned that if I am still single at 50, <laughs> no, I learned for right right now. <laughs> Who's <laughs> yours? Yeah. <laughs> I need to find someone right now to make a pack with just in case I'm single at 50. That's funny. That's Anybody funny. out there, if you're listening, Furland is ready for you right in here? about 20 some odd years. <laughs> That's fantastic. No, absolutely. Because like, you know, it's the foundation of love and it's this mm -hmm. friendship. So did they say that they fell maybe back in love like later down the I, road? I, I, from what I gathered, I think they've always had love for each other. Yeah. And it's just that, um, like as you said before, the stars align and, you know, they hook up. Well, not hook up, but they, they, they're getting married tomorrow. There you go. Yeah, <laughs> Are you literally going to the wedding? Hook up. Am I going to the wedding? I don't know. It depends on what my schedule is. Did you get hired as a photographer? <laughs> I don't know. You should have offered we'll that service for them. <laughs> it would have been free. You know, I just I like them. So you, <laughs> we like people you do things for, you know, for free, right? They yeah. genuinely seem to make each other laugh. Did you get that feeling? No, I absolutely did. It made me laugh as well. And um, they, her, her children were there as well, Kimberly's children, her son and daughter. And um, they approve of this. And um, they really love um, Ron. So yeah. I look forward to seeing what happens with that. Such a cool story. Yeah. Thanks, Berlin. Yeah, thank you. We'll be right back. <laughs>